Shalom. Our praise is going on. Let's go into Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Kakodash. Let's go on to the apostles, bishops, elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessed to the 144,000 of the hopeful elect. This will be another update on the MOTB, which is the MARK of the beast written about and prophesied in Revelation 13 chapter. And this technology is already here and it will fully be fulfilled when it's mandated and everyone is caused to take it. This in particular is dealing with the forehead and the technology that goes inside your brain. What I have here is an article from fortune.com and this here is an update to the Neuralink test that was um, brought out in the news earlier this month. So it says, Elon Musk claims Neuralink's first, first patient implanted with brain see, can already move a computer mouse with their mind. All right. Um, okay, they want you to subscribe. You know what? Let me do this. Let's go to this one. All right, this is from Nova News, and this is essentially the same information. Uh, Musk, first human patient with brain C hip, can control mouse through thought. Progress is good, and the patient seems to have made a full recovery. All right. So it says the first human patient to be implanted with a brain C-hip produced by Neuralink, the startup founded by Elon Musk in 2016. He has fully recovered and is now able to control a computer mouse using his mind. And this is a, a major step towards the fulfillment of uh, Bible prophecy, Revelation 13 and 16, as we here at uh, Great Millstone Israelites, as we teach it the correct way, the 100% truth. Uh, because what's going to happen is the public are going to be offered and mandated this technology It's just a matter of time. So it says it has the same, it was the same man who announced it. Musk during an online event broadcast on platform X, of which he himself is the owner, yeah, formerly Twitter. All right. Uh, it says the patient is able to move the mouse around the screen just by thinking, Musk said adding that Neuralink is trying to get as many mouse clicks of the patient as possible. Okay, January. So it says, in January, Musk announced that his company had successfully implanted a C-hip in his first human patient after receiving approval for human trials in September. When Neuralink said it would start recruiting people, the company said it was looking for individuals with quadriplegia due to cervical spinal cord injury or amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, commonly known as ALS or Lou Gehrig's disease. <clears throat> uh, it says the Neuralink study uses a robot to surgically place a brain-computer interface implant in a region of the brain organ that controls the intention to move. Now, when you go into that, uh, that brain region, uh, that actually controls your motor skills. That's the frontal cortex, all right? In the frontal cortex region behind your forehead, okay? I've done many videos on that region of the brain, which lines up perfectly with what John the Revelator wrote in Revelation 13. So it says, now, with the initial goal of allowing people to control the cursor or keyboard of a computer using their thoughts. See, this is see this technology is going to be considered a miracle. 
All right. This is the next step that Esau wants to push in his uh, movement of transhumanism and to appear as a god to the population of the people on earth using his technology. But getting this technology is going to spell your doom and you're going to have to face evil judgment from Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls God. Okay? And his son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus, the son Yahweh Shai in the Hebrew is going to destroy as well. But he's going to deliver the elect, and the elect are going to be those that don't take this device. So it says, Neuralink, which was valued at about $5 billion last year, has faced repeated calls for scrutiny over its security protocols. But now it's about to get a major boost with these um, successful uh, implants. So now let's go to the scriptures. I should already had a scripture pulled up. But what I want to get is this here. Because we know the, the prophecy in Revelation 13. But what I want to get is these scriptures here. Because there's going to be a deliverance from the destruction, the nuclear destruction that's coming on Babylon the Great. Um, which is America. Soon. It's Revelation 15 and 2. And I saw as it were a sea of glass mingled with fire. And then they had gotten the victory over the beast. And over his image. And over. Right. This is talking about the Neuralink device and other similar devices. The M-A-R-K. And over the number of his name. Stand on the sea of glass having the harps of the Most High. These are the elect. See, the elect are going to be delivered from the destruction. And because they were faithful to the Lord and not taking these devices, man. These devices not only are just going to allow you to control things with thoughts. But we know for damn sure that they're going to eventually be able to. How can I say this? Incept things. Incept Put things in your mind. It works both ways. Computers work both ways. Program and to decode. It was Revelation 16 and 2. And the first went and poured out his vial upon the earth. This is the angel that's going to judge those that have taken these devices. And there fell a noisome and grievous sore upon the men which had the what? The, the MOTB. And upon them which worship his image. And that's where the society is going. A digital cashless society. Or you're going to have to have these physical devices. With, with digital programs on them. Which will allow you to buy and sell. But the Lord is going to send judgment. And a noisome and grievous sore. Upon those that take it. Verse 20. It says and the beast was taken. And with him the false prophet. That. Wrought miracles before him. That's your 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 uh, education system. That's this society, this economic system. That's this religious system. Starting with the Catholic Church, the false prophet. All these, all these systems that are going to use these devices as a somewhat miracle. Okay, to try to re renew. And reorder the society once it collapses globally. There's going to be judgment. And that judgment is going to be nuclear missiles destroying this world. It says, with which he deceived them. See, this is a deceiving thing to take this neural link. They have received the MOTB and them that worship this image. These both were cast alive into a lake of fire burning with brimstone. So that's the society being destroyed. Okay? And the people in it. So if you take this, you're going to get that judgment. Okay? And with this patient 
uh, having a successful recovery and being able to actually move things with thought, that's another step to people having to take it, but also another step towards the judgment and destruction that's to come. So with that, Shalom.